Now, amidst all the excitement and big business talk about the Global Entrepreneurship Summit, there is a critical segment of the Kenyan economy that few people are talking about. Tonight, KTN's Lofty Matambo looks at the place and the space of the Juakali sector in what is going on. This is the sixth edition of the Global Entrepreneurship Summit, one that is expected to have a huge impact on business for the participating countries, especially Kenya, as the host. However, its importance may be lost on the small and medium enterprises, such as the Juakali industry players. To Frederick Kinyanjui, today is a day like any other. And to him, that is investment, making, selling, spending. As for now, Kenya has no direct flight to the U.S. If this is included in the bilateral talks between President Uhuru Kenyatta and President Obama on Saturday, perhaps it could mean robust business for those engaging in export business to the U.S. Um, wale ambao wanafanya biashara na kuharikisha uh, approval zao na mambo mengine kama hayo mimi ningetaka ku export sasa pesa ndio ina kuanga shida eh some of the expected speakers at the long awaited summit include Richard Branson founder of the Virgin Group companies Michael Bloomberg owner of Bloomberg Media a leading business television broadcaster in America and Aliko Dangote owner of Dangote Industries, a leading supplier of cement in West Africa. The caliber and level of discussion expected from these participants and others creating a big gap between the content of the GES 2015 and the needs of the millions of SMEs in Kenya. I hope at Aleza to say, maybe Selecan Ajua Selecan Ajua Italeta your mom. What a remuse come out to remuse my party. Was the Adan Villa Nimesema, Amekua, Akihusika, and Amambohaya, and Afikiri, Wakati to Takuana Round Table, Ile Ambai, Nakuja Sasa, Katia Serekali, and Afani Biashara, Mutaskia Mengi, Ambai to Meweza Kuyatimiza. Currently, the total number of SMEs stands at 7.5 million, contributing to 40% to the 4.7 trillion country's GDP. Out of every 10 jobs created in the country, 8 come from the small-scale business segment. Analysts say any trickle-down effect of the Global Economic Summit targeted at the small and medium enterprises will mean a lot for the Juakali sector. The challenge will be to keep this sector in mind during the summit. Lofty Matambo, KTN News.